Hey there, guys, gals, fans, and pals. Your buddy John Megacycle here. Another episode of Creep World 2 coming at you. Uh, bonus. There we go. Haven't tried these missions yet. Kind of interested to see what these are. Um, I don't know if they're just unique scenarios or what, but let's give it a try. Positronic. Game type obliteration. The finest AI has crafted the challenge you see before you. Are you worthy? I don't know, Abraxas. Is, um, that's all I had. Uh, to be fair, this is nothing like some of the code missions I've seen, so let's give her a go. I could, oh wow. This is a unique experience. I can just straight up economy immediately. It feels really weird. I'm not gonna lie. It feels incredibly weird. I can just go right to power plants. Just let that excavate for a minute. I don't have to start the game losing my uh, mind. So that's neat. Yep, no need to overextend. Why don't you move over a little bit? Oh, I should have waited. Oh, crap. Eh, we're just gonna stop excavating for a minute. Proper power management is probably the biggest enemy of this game. Aside from the creeper, obviously. But you can shoot yourself in the foot so fast by not paying attention to where your money's going and what's happening. Like, very quickly. Very, very quickly. You could just lose everything. Let's, uh... Let's keep building, I guess. I don't see any threats that would make me think I should be doing anything different. Which is usually how they get you. Okay, unit costs 20%. Thank you. I should have just beelined for that, but that's okay. All we built are reactors so far. Okay, one more line of money make. And then we'll switch over to... Uh, tech domes. I don't know what damn well 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 oops there we go uh drones health four no phantoms seven hundred yeah this is this is gonna be easy stuff um but enough with the chit chat let's get some tech online It might be a little slow to build, but we've got enough of an economy now. This is way later than I usually have the opportunity to build tech domes. Because uh, usually I've got to rush them a little earlier, and my economy isn't that great at the time. So this is actually a nice treat. Good, and... I could have built it a little higher. That's all right. Uh, I'm going to plop that thing down right about there. shield -aroo. Not really interested in the mines. As usual, I guess. Okay, just let all that flutter down. that mine itself out yeah this is an impressive amount of economy I usually don't get spoiled like this usually it is significantly more sparse okay 
and Tech Dome efficiency, and we're gonna do that again in a second here. And boop. Getting a lot of that stuff on the early is where you get your biggest payback. We're not in combat right now, so I don't need any of the military research. Um, I kind of don't care when the packets arrive, because there's no way for the packets to be interrupted, so I don't care about that either. So we're kind of in a really good spot. Um, all this will eventually work its way up, but we're going to quell the enemy well before that becomes a feasible threat. Something like that. Dome efficiency. Let's do a little energy storage. I like the energy storage ones the most because they allow for more burst production. Uh... get a beacon right there. Now the thing is, right now, we're kind of playing a waiting game. I can literally take all the time I want to build up whatever I need. Let's do fire rate. How much is this again? It's almost nothing. Um, I wouldn't mind one range upgrade and then we'll push. All this is actually stopped right here. None of this is going to culminate, so this is all also self-contained. And there's 15 for range, and pop. And packet speed, and we'll do another packet speed in a second, there we go. Uh, I'm not going to go that route. Looks good so far, yeah. You can get a lot done even with the lower military levels, even though having a much higher fire rate and movement rate and attack speed is always really, uh, you know, it's good stuff. But we could do, we could do a lot with a little. I don't think I can get that with that emitter there unless I came from this side, which I'm not ready to yet. Uh, fire rate please. That's the end of that, and that's the end of that. Nice. Okay, let's get some more beacons thrown up. Decorate the place real smooth, real smooth. Yeah, we'll just burrow straight down, and we'll mess up this party. Uh, we have lots of other opportunities to economize up, but I don't think we need really any of it. I think we'll be good with level 2 range and fire rate. Um, I don't really have to double down in any investments. Perfect. Uh, let's get packet speed, energy storage... Pop that out. 
Yep, and now they'll freak out and reposition and come back over here. Oh, this is too easy. I feel like I've been spoiled by the by the code missions. Let's keep moving. Build us a nice firing line. Just keep moving. I don't need this anymore. I would love a beacon right there. Um, let's do a beacon upgrade anyway. Oh yeah, we're just steamrolling them now. Yep. Grab a couple turrets, move in a bit. Grab a couple turrets, move in a bit. Grab a couple turrets, move in a bit. Grab a couple turrets, oh, move in a bit. I make the best rhymes. <laughs> Grab a couple turrets, oh, move in a bit. Grab a couple turrets, oh, move in a bit. Yeah, just, just just keep on pushing. Uh, a little more and range is probably going to be the next order of business. for one sale? It looks good to me. Alright, for this, we're going to take this a little bit of a different approach. We're going to pop up in a hole here to give us the most amount of range for how many dudes I've got. Probably a good example of what would be regarded as combat width. Boop. Boop. I'll take Damani. I like a Damani. You could just, uh, oh, never mind. Okay. That was Positronic. Positronic. Not too bad. Not too bad. I think I'm going to keep these bonus missions separate, so I'm not going to do like two or three at a time or whatever. Uh, maybe I'll change my mind. But let's just call this here. Thank you all for joining me. Name's John Megacycle. That was Positronic, the first bonus mission. Yeah, thanks for joining me, and I hope to catch you next time. Hey there, guys, gals, fans, and pals. Thanks for checking out my video. I also want to take a moment to thank all my supporters and donators, and if you'd like to join up with me and Game With My Crew, all the information to get connected is in the description below. Thanks again, and I hope to catch you next time.